This year marks the 26th anniversary of the genocide that took place in Srebrenica. The theme for this year's memorial is rebuilding lives. Throughout this year, I've been visiting communities in Oxford who are coming together to support each other throughout this pandemic. Oxford has such a diverse population and seeing how people from different backgrounds, ethnicity and faith come together to support each other gives me much pride in being a member of the Oxford community. Remembering Srebrenica and what happened there is vital to ensuring that discrimination and racial hatred has no part in our society. It seeks to educate people on how discriminating others from different faiths, a culture can escalate to segregation and ultimately ethnic cleansing. We at Oxford City Council believe that we must ensure that we never forget the genocide and reaffirm our commitment to stand up against all forms of hatred and prejudice that targets groups based on their religion, ethnicity, gender, sexuality and or any type of difference. The theme of the 26th anniversary of Srebrenica genocide is never again. Tragically, human beings seem not to learn lessons from history. It need not be like that. It seems to me that the key to ensuring those who spread hate, violence and division, those who perpetuate stereotypes of othering and thereby seek to strip others of their inalienable right to dignity by the very virtue of their humanity, must be challenged. The antidote to such hateful narratives has to be education and the creation of shared spaces for sharing of stories, of dialogue, of building friendships, of celebrating through beautiful art, literature, poetry and music. By doing so, we will not only undermine the roots of hatred and the perpetuation of othering, but create relationships rooted in love, understanding and mutual respect. And that is how we honour the lives of all those killed in Srebrenica genocide. May God bless all the victims and their families with his love, compassion and mercy. Amen. We pray for those who mourn loved ones lost at Srebrenica. We pray for those suffering personal grief all these years on. We pray for communities near at home or far afield where there is hatred and fear, mistrust and ignorance. Have mercy, Lord, when you see our failure to act to defend our neighbour. Have mercy, Lord, when you see the hate and prejudice grow within. Open our hands our hearts and our minds, that we would treat others as we would want to be treated, that we would love our neighbour as we love ourselves. Amen. Today I would like to read to you the Srebrenica pledges and commit the City Council in Oxford and the City of Oxford to honouring them. We pledge that when we hear the language of us and them, we'll reach out and find common ground with our neighbour. We pledge that when we hear stereotyping and scapegoating, we will find and share alternative positive stories. We pledge that when we see discrimination in our schools or workplaces, we will challenge this and promote equal opportunities for all. We pledge that when we hear dehumanising language, we will remind the speaker of our common humanity. We pledge that when we see members of our community becoming disenfranchised, we will make a concerted effort to engage and include them. We pledge that when we hear divisive propaganda, we will challenge this effectively. We pledge that we will protect those who speak out against human rights abuses. We pledge that where we see persecution, we will do everything in our power to protect those who are suffering. We pledge that where we believe that extermination is taking place, we will call on our governments and the international community to take immediate action. We pledge that we will always challenge denial by believing the victims and sharing their stories. And we pledge that we will always choose the side of those who are suffering over the side of the oppressor. Today, these messages and these pledges remain 
incredibly important and these are the lessons and the pledges that we try to live at Oxford City Council.